Hi guys, my name is Marissa. I am a certified personal trainer and I am here to help you navigate the amazing world of YouTube influencer workouts. Today I will be reviewing Pamela Reeves 10 minute six pack ab workout. She has a lot of different workouts, but I asked you guys on my Instagram which ones I should try and the majority said her six pack workouts. So I did the most popular one, the first one that popped up on my page. I have never even looked at any of her workouts before. So this is completely new to me. I've heard her workouts are challenging, but I'm here to put that to the test. I'm going to be rating her workout on effectiveness, enjoyment, and intensity. You can compare and contrast with all of the other influencers I've reviewed so far and will be reviewing in the future to make the best decision for you. If you are not subscribed already, I would highly recommend doing so. I am going to continue this series with a variety of different influencers. I have already done Chloe Ting, Mad Fit, and Gabriella Whited. And I'm always taking suggestions as to whose workouts I should look at next. So comment below who you think I should review next and eventually I will get to everybody. I have a long list already. The more I see someone's name in the comments, the more motivated I am to get to that person first. So if you really want me to do a specific one or a specific workout for an individual, please comment it below. And I wouldn't mind doing like, let's say another one of Pamela Reef's workouts or another one of Madfit's workouts in the future. In addition to that, I will be doing my own workout program on YouTube. So please also comment what you would like to see from me. Maybe it's something different than anything you've seen from other influencers before on this platform. I really want to make whatever is in the highest demand for you, whether it's a resistance training workout with no equipment, a 20 minute HIIT workout, an ab workout, something that the majority would love to see. And if you're looking for a more individualized approach, I do online personal training as well, and you can check that out in the description. I filmed myself doing this workout last night in my mom's garage, so let's get into that. I'm gonna have to give that a 5 out of 10. I really did not enjoy it that much just because, well, of course my circumstances, I was in a 90 degree garage with flies attacking my face, but that has nothing to do with her and her workout, but she didn't give you a rest time and I feel like that is somewhat necessary. Um, I definitely like feeling a burn as you should with an ab workout, but it was really overkill. However, I do think that can go a long way for some people, maybe not beginners. I would recommend something with a break 
for beginners just so they don't get discouraged. And a lot of the ab exercises were more focused on the lower abdominal region and a lot of those like the leg raises tend to hurt my hips just because of how my hips are aligned, there's a lot of popping going on, and it makes it really uncomfortable to perform the exercises. That's why it wasn't all that enjoyable for me, but again, just my opinion, could be totally different for somebody else. For effectiveness, I am going to rate it a 10 out of 10. I do think that 10 minutes just going without a rest time can be very effective for results, maybe not for motivation and wanting to go back to that specific workout if it's causing you pain but i definitely think if you did this workout long term you could see pretty great results with what she's offering lastly intensity i would give that a 10 out of 10 also there were points where i had to stop just because i couldn't complete them if you've been following me for a while you know that abs are not my strong suit i don't really strive to have a six pack ever i don't think they look that great on me so i don't try to get them, which means maybe my core strength isn't as great as it should be. So when doing that workout, it was all fine until I started getting to those side planks and all the different variations of movements with the side planks. That's when I just had to sit down, I had to take a break. Especially when you don't get a break between exercises. It's back to back to back and that can really make it difficult to continue. However, I tried to power through it. I did not get to the last two exercises because flies were trying to attack my face, but that's okay. I still, I looked at them and I was like, okay, it's basically all the same things that we have already done. It seemed pretty repetitive, but overall, really effective workout. I would place it more so in the intermediate slash advanced category rather than beginners. I think maybe the Chloe Ting ab workouts would be better for beginners just to feel things out. And just that 10 second break can really go a long way in between sets. So yeah, those are my thoughts on Pamela Reeves' 10 minute six pack ab workout. Let me know again in the comments what you'd like to see next and I will see you later.